Carlo with Rise to Walk. Thanks for joining me. And this is an announcement video for a read through for Lent. But before we get started, a little bit about this channel. Here we share good thoughts about good words. And on Fridays, I host a live Bible study on Instagram at Race to Walk. And then I publish two videos a week. I publish a replay of that Bible study with some study aids as well as a video about books. So if you are interested in either of those things, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and hit the bell for notifications so you can get updates about new videos. So about this read-through. And this read-through is spearheaded by Christy Lewis at Dotoeski in Space, and she invited me to participate. And I said, sure, that sounds like fun. And the other two people that are going to be part of this read-through are Alan at the Library at Alexandria and uh, Victoria at the Musical Book Board. So what is the plan? Uh, we are reading John Plowman's Talks by Charles Spurgeon, and we are starting on the be at the beginning of Lent on Ash Wednesday, February 17th. We're going to be reading up through the Friday before Easter, and we're going to be having a live stream discussion on April 3rd. So you are invited to join us in this read through. So here's the thing. This is a book that I got. The talks are actually also available online. I'm going to put a link in the description to a page on my website that I have an overview of the read through with a link to the, the book online. Um, also a link to this edition and as well as the discord group that we're going to be doing the discussion through. So how is this going to run down? Um, you can just read the whole thing if you want. Uh, but there, I, we did post a schedule if you just want to read a little bit every time. And it basically works out to one talk or chapter every other day. And each of the talks or chapters are pretty short. They're most of the time they're about five pages. Sometimes I think the longest one is like 10, 15 or something like that. If you're just reading a little bit every other day, it's not a huge kind of time commitment. Now I have a link to this book online on my website. You don't have to buy a book. And there are some editions that just have the talks. This edition that I got actually includes two books. It includes John Plowman's talks as well as uh, John Plowman's Pictures, which is just kind of like a sequel to the talks, which is pretty popular. This particular edition doesn't have any commentary or resources or anything. It's just what was originally published. I am reading through John Plowman's Pictures, which is the book two right now. So when we get through John Plowman's talks during this read through, I'll have read the whole book. So a little bit about the discussion group. It's a book club listed on Caravan app, which seems like it's kind of like an aggregator for book clubs that are hosted on Discord. And what is Discord? I had signed up for an account a while ago, but I hadn't really used it. And I'm just kind of getting into it. So it kind of reminds me of old school internet. So it's just kind of like these message boards, sort of. You can create your own there. And um, anyway, I, I don't know how to explain it. I guess you can do voice chats and videos and things like that. I don't know. I'm still kind of exploring it. I'm going to have a link in the description to the discussion group that's set up. And we do have on there, we do have the, the schedule of the readings. And I also have a link to a PDF of the schedule on my website. So anyway, I hope you join us for this read through. I really enjoyed the pictures that I started reading through. I think it's going to be kind of an experience reading the words of a 19th century British Baptist pastor for like, I don't know about you. I'm not Catholic. I've been in church my whole life, but it's always been, been very low, low church. And so I didn't even know what Lent was until just a few years ago. I, I do do a read through of Psalms every year, you know, between the time between Easter and uh, Pentecost, but doing a read through for Lent is going to be something new for me. So I hope you join us for this. But anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.